This week, Donald Trump is making his case to New York voters, giving speeches which consist, as they usually do, of long portions that attack people that he's not even running against. And Mitt Romney made a few appearances uh, in his speech, as he always does. But in attacking Mitt Romney, look at the way that he chose to do it. And as you watch this video, bear in mind that he's in New York when he's delivering these remarks. We've had Obama far too long. The last election should have been won, except Romney choked like a dog. He choked. He went, I can't breathe. I can't breathe, he said. Nothing. You don't think so? Okay, so the claim that is being made and that I will make is, uh, I, I said before the show, I've seen people talk about people choking hundreds of times over the course of my life. Like Kobe choked and everybody choked. Not last night, he did well. But people always choke. They say that, they're not so committed to the metaphor that they then talk about not being able to breathe. I've never seen that happen. And in New York, where Eric Garner was choked to death by the police and famously had the last words, I can't breathe, I can't breathe. I don't understand what would lead Donald Trump to think that in a completely unrelated context, making fun of that is a good idea. But I can't imagine why anyone would say that for any other reason in New York. I got to I'm with you on this, John. Oh, really? I thought that I would be one out of three. Huh? No, no, no. I'm with you on it. I, I mean, whenever you say someone choke, you're like, ah. you don't say, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. And, I can't and breathe. since this guy has a history of dog whistles and racist statements, it makes me think he, can, he did it in a way that he can go, no, 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 I, I didn't mean anything by it. When he definitely meant something by it. Yeah. Yeah, look, it almost seems too smart for him. Mm -hmm. to, to, to know that some of the, 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 the extremely racist followers that he has in New York would, would recognize that reference and think that it was funny. There all is also, I'm going to give a small chance that it is as random as it seems. And the only reason I'm acknowledge that is because he uses the expression choked like a dog. And I have no idea what that means. I, I have a dog. I've had a dog most of my life. And I don't, when I think of a dog, I don't think of them choking. I don't understand what that's about. So maybe he's just being random, but it seems incredibly racially insensitive. Uh, he's not going to care, of course. His supporters are not going to care. <coughs> but I would show a little bit more tact considering that as, as quick as they are to label everyone killed by the police as thugs who had it coming, this is a guy who was choked out in broad daylight who did not need to die. It seems like a step too far e even for Trump to mock Literally that man. Literally for selling Lucy's on the street. Yeah. Yeah. Perhaps the least consequential crime that I can yeah. imagine.